Hey, Body Food family. My name is Isabella. I'm the owner of two six-figure online businesses, and today I'm going to be sharing with you guys my process of content creation. Content creation is the most important thing for your business to grow online, and this is the content that I create. You guys know I do not spend any money for any ads. I would never recommend you guys ever buying Facebook ads or ever paying for any ad service or influencers. You guys can do this all on your own. But you guys already know how I feel. It's 25% the product, 75% how you market it. So not only am I going to be telling you guys what you should do, but I'm going to be physically showing you guys my creative process and what I do and exactly just showing you guys how we create these videos and I'm also going to be editing one for you guys because a lot of you guys have been asking a lot of questions about how I edit on my phone I take all of our content creation on my phone I've never paid for an ad so I do this all on my own from my iPhone and through TikTok and Instagram TikTok being the number one platform and Instagram now that it has reels has really been promoting my online business as well so I'm gonna be sharing with you guys how we have done that as well and what's super awesome is that I I just basically recycle all of the TikToks and I just have been posting them on Instagram Reels. So I'm gonna be showing you guys how I make these videos and how they're always going viral. Most of our videos, we have very high engagement and I grew this account from zero to 600K in less than a year. So I'm gonna be showing you guys how we create that content and how you guys can do exactly the same with your own products too. So let's get right into this video. So I always wait until the evening time to capture the best lighting possible by natural light. I always try to get on the same level as my products and I always try to make sure that they are centered so when I post them on TikTok and Instagram, they will be centered in the frame. And even if this was artificial lighting, nothing is better than golden hour type of lighting. And you could go outside to do this as well. You don't have to do this inside. So once you guys have your video, then you're going to go into your phone and you're going to download this app. It's called InShot. This app has been literally amazing for me. I edit all of our YouTube videos on this app. I, I literally edit everything from this app. So it's really awesome. And I'm going to show you guys exactly how we do this. So I click on video and I click new and I click on the video that I want. So I wanna show you guys how we edited our packaging video because you guys do know that I believe strongly in showing as much behind the scenes as you can. It helps people to trust you and it also helps people to get excited to order from you. So I'm gonna select everything that I saved for this video. There we go. And let me close out of this. And you guys can see, I just like kind of recorded a bunch of different videos here. So all my videos, I always keep either under 10 seconds or 10 to 15 seconds. I try not to go above that because I feel like if it's too long, people will just keep swiping. So we want to just keep the retention as long as possible. That's definitely the goal to keep when creating content, especially for TikTok. So basically the first thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to listen. I actually didn't record, record any audio with this, which I'm going to be sharing with you guys how we record with my voice and everything. So I'm going to be showing you guys everything. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to just cut this down. So I just kind of like like the inside of the box, like right there. And you guys just, I also just showed you guys um, earlier in this video, like I always do this with lighting. So you guys see this was golden hour time. So I'm just going to like show the box. Okay, I kind of like that frantic movement. So I'm going to show the box. So people are like, what the heck is she doing? All right, so I'm going to cut this down as much as possible, right? Let's see what's next. So then I'm grabbing it and I'm showing the item off the shelf. Because you guys know I have these shelfings back there because I do like to show the products, which I also will show you guys in this video earlier on. Okay, so I'm going to basically just cut this as much as I can. And then right before I start to move it around, I'm going to slit, slit, split it. And then I'm going to click on that clip and click speed and then I'm going to speed that up so because we don't want any like extra time of me going like that like that's wasting time for the video because remember we're trying to hit this we're trying to keep this video under 10 seconds or under 15 seconds so let's see so there we go so then I'm gonna so now that I did that I'm just gonna cut this one a little bit and I always like just watch it as I'm doing it too okay that looks pretty good and I'm just gonna like speed that up just a little bit just a tint just like that. Okay, and then I'm also, so this was a second boba bundle that she ordered. This was a BFF boba, so I'm just showing it. Okay, so I'm just gonna stop it right where we left it. There was a lip gloss that she ordered, so I'm just gonna cut that randomly, like that's not that serious. And then I'm, and then I'm basically just dragging these arrows together, and that's what's like cutting it and keeping the clip shorter. This app, I promise, is very easy to use. You just need a little practice with it. So then after that, so then they also ordered this new body oil that I just made because now I'm developing beauty products that I'm creating at home. So I just wanted to show, so first I'm going to show like that. I'm going to slip that again and then I'm going to go down to where the bobas fall 
and then I'm just gonna let them fall and then I'm gonna cut it again and I think that looks pretty good okay okay I kind of like how the bows fall so I'm gonna delete this in between you guys see all I'm doing is I'm basically just like eliminating it as much as I can and only showing like the highlights of this video so now that that's done so I'm gonna speed that up because you don't want it like too fast but you just don't want it to be too slow either I'm gonna speed that up and cut it down a little bit and see where we are okay and then I'm gonna go through this okay so I'm just watching it so I think that looks really good so I'm gonna cut that down again and they always like crunchy noises too on TikTok so we're gonna leave that crunch so we're gonna just leave that crunch usually I mute the videos though and okay so we put that in the box okay and then let's cut that and then I also just showed this again, but it kind of looks bad. Okay, I'm just going to show it like that. There we go. And like that. There we go. Okay, so now that the video is done, the second biggest reason why my videos I feel like always go viral is because I use my voice. And I know you guys have a unique voice. Everyone does. And you guys can all use your voices too in your videos. And not only does that make them trust you more, but it makes your videos stand out from other people on TikTok. Because a lot of people on TikTok are afraid to use their voice. So... Don't be afraid. Use your voice. You're gonna. You're trying to do this to make money, so just use your voice. Don't be afraid. Okay. So and nobody can see your face anyway. So like, what do you have to lose? Nobody will know it's you saying it if you're embarrassed of your voice. So okay. So I'm just gonna watch it one more time before I start recording, and make sure this looks good. That was a little slow there, so I'm just gonna cut it down. There we go. Okay. I think that's looking pretty good, you guys. Maybe just a. I'm just gonna speed this one up a little bit. Okay, I think that looks pretty good. So, under 10 seconds. Okay, so it's 11 seconds, so not too bad. I think that's perfect. So now that the video's done, we're going to record. So how to, how you're going to record is you're going to go over and you are going and you're going to find the music button. So you're going to click the music button on this app. And then if you want to add your own custom music, you can do that in the tracks button, but for right now we're going to click record. And 3, 2. Let's package an order for somebody that loves purple. Let's package an order for somebody that loves purple. So I always do it in slices too, so you don't, you can't hear me like breathing or anything. So then I do it like in slices. Oh. So hang on. Okay. She ordered one purple bubble bundle. One BFF bundle. One bubble popsicle lip gloss. Oh, it was too long, so I'm going to redo that one. So just click the redo button. One popsicle lip gloss and one body oil. One popsicle lip gloss and one body oil. Their skin is going to glow with this. And one body oil. Their skin is going to glow with this. Let's package it up. And add her free stickers. Can't wait to get it. Her free stickers. Can't wait. So the end, it kind of got messed up. So I'm just gonna extend this a little bit more, like that. Um, or you know what I can also do is like I'm just gonna slow it down a little bit so it fits. Okay. I can do that. I can't wait till you get it. I can do that. I can do that. Here's our free stickers. Can't wait till you get this. Can't wait till you get this. Can't wait till you get this. It's still kind of cut, so I'm just going to go back. Can't wait till you get this. Perfect. We got it, you guys. Okay, so we're going to hit X. Okay, now let's just watch it one more time to make sure it's good. This is what I always do every time. For somebody that loves purple. She ordered one purple bubble bundle, one BFF bundle, one popsicle lip gloss, and one body oil. Your skin is going to glow with this. Let's package it up. Here's our first stick. Can't wait till you get this. And that is our video. So that took me literally 10 minutes to make. And this video alone, if it goes viral, could make thousands of dollars in one day. So basically, because it's happened many times. So we're going to click this checkbox now. And we're going to go up to this and click save. And this app is 100% free, you guys. And it takes like one second to save it. So after that, I go into TikTok and I click on the plus button. And I'm going to click upload. And we're going to upload this one. Okay, and then it's kind of like quiet, and it's kind of quiet, so I'm going to add a song with this. So I'm going to click, sometimes their suggested songs are so on point, so I'm going to actually try a suggested sound and see how it looks. I think 
the sound that they suggested is actually perfect, so I'm going to go ahead and use this sound. And it's not too loud, so I don't have to adjust the volume because you guys have to be careful. Sometimes if it's too loud, then they can't hear your voice, and that defeats the purpose of using your voice. So I think it's pretty good, and then what I'm going to do is I always select a cover, so I'm going to select just something that looks pretty good. So I think I'm going to do, let's see here. Okay, I think I'll go ahead and just select, I think the Boba Bundle one is cute. So I'll do that one, and then I'm going to put here... Um, packaging and order and I usually will put their names too and like what state they're from because TikTok actually like say you say Texas here okay so packaging order for let's just pretend Betty from Texas I have to check and see who it was actually for and if you actually write Texas there it actually will actually show your video to people from Texas so if you have a target state audience this will help for that too so I'm just gonna save it for a draft as well but if not you'll click post and then I always just use hashtags that fit within my niche do not use the small business hashtag because if you use that, it's only going to show your content to other small businesses. You need to be targeting who your audience is. So if you're selling blenders, for example, fruit blenders, you need to tag um, like food ASMR or like you need to tag things that are relevant to the food or health industry. So with TikTok, you usually post three to four hashtags and Instagram is a little different. So I'm going to show you guys what I do to save all these hashtags. So I have a place on my phone where I keep all of the hashtags and I store them on my phone so I can copy and paste them. And this really just took me five minutes to just really go through Instagram and see trending hashtags for the niche that I'm in. So again, if you're in the health, you'll do like healthy types of hashtags. If you're in beauty, you'll do beauty hashtags and so on and so forth. So we're going to go to Instagram and we are going to click the reel button up here and you're going to swipe up and add your reel. So we're gonna click add and then click preview. And then basically you can pick your cover here. I always have to can cancel out and try again to actually show up. So then you can pick your cover out here of what you want to show in the profile, in the image, and then you can go to caption and you're gonna write your caption. Try to include as many keywords as you can in this caption. So for example, I'm gonna pretty much say everything that she ordered in this caption. So I'm gonna do it like packaging and order for, and I'm gonna put like the, just the first name from Texas. And then I do like cute emojis, like, you know, just anything that's gonna just draw more attention. And I don't wanna put too many emojis cause you don't want it to look too crazy. So then I usually just post two emojis in that. And then I'm gonna start using hashtags. So do, I wouldn't use lip gloss business hashtags because that could just put you guys on other business owners like feed and you don't want that. So I would just put, um, you could just do like boba and I just, so then basically I'll just make this space. So then once I've downloaded my caption, I click return and then I click these two things here. I don't even know what those are called. And then, and then you click here and you're gonna paste in your notes. So you're gonna just copy everything that you keep stored in your notes and you're gonna just paste it here and then you can click share and it's really that easy and Instagram has really been promoting my products which I'm gonna show you guys right now and as you guys can see I've been getting tons of views on my Instagram videos like this is crazy you guys been like 100k 140k sometimes I will go viral with a video on TikTok I post the same video to Instagram and it gets not that many views, but then I'll have a video that doesn't go as viral on TikTok and I post it to Instagram Reels and it gets so many views more than it did on TikTok. Definitely, definitely start using Instagram Reels for your business as well because it obviously has brought in a lot of exposure for me and there's a different kind of crowd of people on Instagram than TikTok too, so I definitely recommend utilizing Reels as much as you can. But the content layout is exactly the same. You basically are just posting to Reels as well as TikTok. I hope this video helped you and I will see you guys in my next video. Hit that subscribe button if this helped you and hit that like button so I can keep making videos like this. Comment down below if you guys have any questions at all. I try to answer all of you guys' questions in the comments. So this is an area that you guys can ask me questions and you will also help others 